were looking for a friend of Dulacis. Uh, when we came to here, where there's obviously just been a fire, and we came to a group of women who told us that uh, it was six uh, structures, six homes that belonged to three families, and that this morning there was a big fire. Uh, that the families that own this property here, or, or this where they live in this refugee camp, Jabal, uh, are still out in their gardens. And while they were away, uh, some of the little children were playing in the kitchen, and that's how the, the fire started. And uh, this is exactly one of the things that, uh, when first talking with uh, some of our refugee friends, when they started telling us about the, the need of uh, preschool, it was one of the main reasons that they first brought up that the children are left unattended because the parents have to go out and somehow bring more food or, or firewood or get the water. They have to do whatever they need to survive uh, and they just have to leave the children and uh, fire is, is one of the big things. This time nobody got hurt but I've heard often of uh, big fires that sometimes burn a lot more than six homes and uh, end up uh, hurting children and people have died in the fire. So. Gracias.